Because I believe my purpose on earth is not to have children. It's not to build houses. It's not to have money. But to contribute to humanity and to add value to society in a selfless manner without intending to generate any, anything out of it, but to contribute selflessly to my society and for the benefit of humanity. And that is the one great fulfillment I'm looking forward to. House of Memory for Omoba Yemisi Shilon. My, oh, my, oh, my, oh. When I got to the gate of a visual edifice, I did not need to ask the wind whether or not you are truly the son of a king. When I pressed the bell carved in an ostrich's image, his sculpture answered the bell with an eloquent ease. Because in your mansion of a million crabs, Omoba, Carvings have tongues. They speak the language of a thousand years. If the future demands to know our father's names, we shall trace our origins to your memories. Island of wondrous treasure. Paintings have eyes. They beckon at the guest with their lunar wings. Sculptures have mouths. They salute the guest with a royal mien. Installations have manners. They usher the guest into the dining hall. If the future demands to know our father's names, we shall trace our origins to your memories, house. Because you are a seer in the pantheon of hearts. You can see a peel in the belly of the sea. Because you have the eyes of a sage, you see the beauty that lies in the belly of a wood. Long before the cover turns its fate into a masterpiece, Oh, because you have a sage's ears, you perceive the loaded music of a distant drum. And so when time demands to know our father's names, Amoba, we shall trace our memory to your memory's house. But you have preserved our past in your visual citadel. We know that the communal museum is in the grip of termites. 
or the day they demand to know our father's names, or the day they demand who our fathers are, we shall trace our heritage to your memories house. I bear testimony to the kindness of Olugo, who rewards the chameleon for its coloring myth. I doff my heart for Olokon, who rewards the electric fish for its shocking heart. When you went to the cape and saw the wings of Eyagbe, you collected a feather and paid in pounds for the birds to eat and replenish its stock. Oh, when you visited the coast and saw a yalu, you collected a quill and paid in peels for the birds to eat and replenish stock. Inspirer of the written word, you are a friend of the drummer and a patron of the string. You have collected art so much with a mystic passion. And you have become an art in your river prime. Ah, Omoba. When time demands to know our father's names, we shall trace our heritage to your memories. House. <laughs> Hallelujah, 